All right, so our print came out. I gotta trim this, trim these edges, trim all this out. Boom. Bam. All right. And this might be a slight overlay. So we're gonna go ahead and get this down. And again, this is my first time doing a sublamination layer. So I don't know how it's gonna turn out. I'm gonna make sure those are facing inward. Push that all the way to the edge so we get all that image in there. And then again, we're going to cover the top because that sublimination is bleed. And let's go ahead and press it out. Again, that's going to press for about 55 seconds. This is a scrap piece. I'm gonna do this for the actual plaque. So come on over and we're gonna go to our previous image. And this time I'm gonna do this. I gotta make sure I size this correctly. Go ahead and pull that and see what it looks like. Wish me luck, people. Let's see. Mm, no, no, no. I don't like the way that turned out. That side looks nice. But for some odd reason, that side didn't come out too well. So we're gonna go ahead and move forward to the next side. That press. All right, we're gonna come over here. And that's going to be about six inches wide. Seven inches in length. A little over seven inches, so that works. We're gonna go ahead and print that out. And while we're doing this, while we're waiting on that, I gotta peel this little seal off. Let's get that. Yeah, that turned out nice. Maybe I'll leave that, maybe I'll just do one side. Because I don't like the way that turned out. plastic off. And the 
looks nice. And we're gonna go ahead. For some reason, that side ain't turning out nice. We're gonna have to do something about that for uh, future purposes. And then you always wanna kind of remove this out the way. But this is my first pillowcase. I'm going to use that. Maybe it'll turn out different. Excuse me. We're gonna come in and trim this. You wanna lay that down like that, so you see all the images, the couple, no items, no heads are cut off, and that looks good. And at this point, I'm gonna go ahead and get this taped down. Come on over, let's see how this turns out. All right, again, that side looks perfect. This side, I may need to put like a, what they call a Teflon pillow to raise it up off of this surface or that seam. But let's see, that might turn out pretty pretty nice once I stuff it. So we can go ahead and get that to the side. And we're gonna stuff that in a few minutes here. But overall, I mean, it turned out nice. It looks pretty good. So we're gonna go ahead and get ready for our, our frame. I'm just gonna fold this up just to make sure. We're gonna keep that heat the same. And we're gonna go ahead and press that out. And while we're waiting on that, let's unzip our pillow. Let's see if we can begin stuffing. So you get this pillow stuff from Hobby Lobby, Joanne Fabrics, anywhere. I think we even have it at Walmart. Okay, I might need a lot more, which I do have, not a problem. You want to get that all down in the corners down there. So I got to go uh, get some more of the rest of it. I got it in the other room. So bear with me for a moment. 
We got seven seconds here, so I'm gonna pull it over here. Let's see how this turns out. Never did this love frame, so we about to see. There we go. Can you see that? Get that under the light. Now what I may have to do, you see that white part right there? I can fix that. Or it doesn't matter. 